representation. Now let me throw in some more complicated numbers and see how it goes. Suppose I had the number 2.4 times 10 to the 14 and I divided it by 0 0.6 times 10 to the 3. How would I do that? Well, first I can I, I can I can separate this out into two different problems. I can say 2.4 2 divided by 0 0.6. But first I'll, I'll divide 2.4 over 0 0.6. If I do that, I get 0 0.4. Oops. If I divide 2.4 over 0 0.6, I get 4. Sorry. Now, if I divide 10 to the 14 over 10 to the 3, then I get 10 to the 14 minus 3. That is equal to 4 times 14 minus 3 is 11. 4 times 10 to the 11. So 2.4 times 10 to the 14 over 0 0.6 times 10 to the 3 is 4 times 10 to the 11. Let me point out something about your calculators. Calculators and computers um, were programmed a long time ago when they didn't have very many, uh, they didn't have very good displays. And there was a convention that was made a long time ago to deal with exponential notation on those displays. So what they did was this. They said, we can't easily write out a number like 1.2 times 10 to the 14 in our display because there was just no way of writing that little tiny 14. All they could write was just big numbers. And so this is what they did. They wrote 1.2 E 14. This is the same thing as that. So E stands in for times 10 to the 14. 1.2 E 14 on a calculator It's exactly the same thing as 1.2 times 10 to the 14. So, for example, if you write in a number in your calculator like 0 0.00034 and you hit the enter sign, your calculator might just give you something like this. It might give you 2, 3, 4, 3.4 e minus 4. What does that mean? Well, 3.4 e minus 4. e means times 10 to the whatever. So 3.4 e minus 4, I would write 3.4 times minus 10 to the minus 4. So this number up here is the exponent there. e is short for the word exponent. 3.4 times 10 to the minus 4 is the same thing as 3.4 e minus 4. And we can verify that 3.4 times 10 to the minus 4 is equal to point oh 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 three four. Let's just do that one more time. 3.4 times, now 10 to the minus 4 is a 1 with the one with the decimal point moved four places, minus four places to the right. That's the same thing as four places to the left, so let's move that decimal point. One, two, three, four places to the left. I move it here, so I've got to get rid of it there, so I've really moved it. Zero, zero, fill this in with zeros. 3.4 times point zero, 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 one. And you can verify yourself. That's equal to point zero, 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 three, four. All these things are ways of writing exactly the same number.